Well, hello everybody. Denise here, The Crafty DIYer. How are you doing today? I got a good one for you. This is an envelope. So we're gonna put this together today so I can show you guys how to do that. Regular paper. Now again, when I say regular paper, it's 32 pound bright white. It's copy paper, but it's a little heavier and it's a bright white. This is for color paper. So we're gonna do that one today. And then we're gonna put this one together as well. Let's get into the fun stuff. These here, we're gonna fold like this. I'm just gonna get to it. This is kind of like the seam, right? Kind of like a seam of, of if you've been sewing. All right, let's fold this one in there. Then we're gonna fold this in front like so. So this is gonna be their front. This is gonna be our pocket, okay? Now you're gonna take this here, see this here? See this fold, okay? We're gonna fold that in itself, like so. So that's now the back, okay? Let me glue this in. There we go, that and now. We're gonna put that in there. You still have a little bit of white here, right? So that's when you just take your ink. And if it's folded over a little bit, like if it's out too far, if you didn't fold it completely, just trim it, it's okay. You have now a really pretty pocket. So you could do so much with this. You could put one of these in there that it does fit see how we have some extra space here see that it's like a little pocket with some space if we didn't have those little extra pieces there this would be flat you'd only get so many so you could literally store a bunch of these in here okay if you're building out a journal you could take this and glue it on if you want it. I know that's so pretty, right? It seems like a shame to cover it up, but you don't have to. You could take this, create a pocket, and put that in there. Like you can make a pocket out of a pocket. That's what we're gonna make right here. So very similar. We have these little, I'm gonna call them seam allowance because that's just seems, ha, ah, get it? Seems to be like a seam allowance. <laughs> these are the lines like right in the middle. Okay, so I'm going to bring this up. So I'm just going to adjust it here. So I'm watching this line up here. Not the line, but I'm going to do that. And then I'm just going to see where we are here. Okay. There we go. And then we're going to bring down our lid. There we go. So now I'm going to crease everything. This just makes it look nice and finished. See this crease here? I'm actually going to fold it back and I'm going to hit it with this, this here. Let's glue this up. All right. I want to bring this green down in a bit because it's, it's really picking up the green on the, the leaves. Look how simple and easy those were. And you could take these, so you could store your journal cards in them, right? And because we have that little extra piece there, it's more like a pocket rather than just something you can just slip in. So these are journal cards and I printed, I printed on the back, but let's make a little tab. And it's so you can pull it in and out Right, so you would grab it and you can pull it in and out. You could do it on the side like this. We're gonna do both ways. This is an EK, so that's the brand, EK. And it's a punch, okay? And it's gonna punch out the tab. I'm gonna make my tab pink. I'm gonna look at it this way, pop it out. And then all you do is just fold it, just like so. And then let's just add a little bit of ink to everything. 
You can do square, but I like using my little corner rounder. Okay, there we go. Let's just say this was a pocket in here. You would just take this and stick it out like that. Okay, so now you've got your pockets. Pretend this is a pocket. So I'll put this in here and then we'll put this in here. And we have some cute little tags. All right, let's use that. And I'm going to kind of scrunch it up a little. And then the back is going to be plain, which is fine. Here, let's do this. How cute is that? All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me again. I appreciate every single one of you.